For today's winter card, I'm going to use a small wrist die from Holy Wrist set and few stamps from Warm Cocoa Wishes. Full supply list you can find in the description below this video. I'm starting with stamping a sentiment with a clear embossing ink on the red card panel. Red and gold is my favorite color combo for a Christmas card and I decided to make a gold sentiment on the card using embossing powder. Before stamping I forgot to use my anti-static pillow and now I need to remove all extra powder from the card with a small paint brush. I'm heating the sentiment with a heat gun. Always allow your heat gun to warm up before you start embossing to get nice embossed image. Next I'm temporarily adhering my card panel to the glass mat with a new double-sided tape. I'm covering the card panel with a stencil. For the first layer of the snowflakes I'm going to use a dark red Nuvo Hybrid ink. I'm dabbing ink all over the card panel, but I'm not adding ink in the center where my sentiment is. Also you can apply ink through the stencil with the Nuvo blending brushes. After removing the stencil I got a pretty snowflakes and the focal point on the sentiment. For the second layer I'm going to use a glimmer paste called Moonstone. It's a dimensional paste with a high concentration of glitter. The transparent colors like this one are affected by the color beneath them. So on my red cardstock I will get snowflakes with a gold shine. I'm applying paste with a palette knife. Uh, I'm starting with a small amount of the paste and next I will add more if needed. That's how I will get nice crisp snowflakes. But don't forget to clean the stencil after you're done applying paste. You can wash it in the water or remove paste with a baby wipe. I'm not applying paste in the center to keep the sentiment clean. If you want, you can cover the sentiment with a piece of paper to protect it. Now I let the panel to dry and I'm going to stamp and color two birds. I'm stamping images with a black Nouveau Hybrid ink, alcohol markers friendly ink, on the ultra smooth craft perfect paper. I'm going to quick color my birds with the Nouveau markers and cut out them with scissors. Using a wrist die I die cut two pieces from a green and a white cardstock. Also I cut out a bow from the gold mirror cardstock. I used two bow dies from the same die set. I'm adhering two wrists together to create a one wrist with a white shadow behind. Next I'm adhering the card panel on the red card base with a double sided adhesive sheet. After that card panel will not be carved anymore. I'm adhering the wrist over the sentiment with a double-sided adhesive foam. Using liquid glue, I'm adhering birds and the bow on the wrist. I decided that sentiment is not visible enough and I'm highlighting it with a white gel pen. To add more contents on the card, I'm applying white opaque Nuvo drops. I'm trying to do not make a huge dots, only small one here and there. And here is my finished card, hope you will like it and don't forget to subscribe, see you soon, bye!